In a fiery response to Labour's latest budget announcement, farmers across the UK are rallying against what they're calling the tractor tax. Under new rules revealed by Rachel Reeves, farms valued over £1 million will face a 20% inheritance tax starting April 2026. The farming community is outraged, warning that this move will devastate family-owned farms, forcing some to sell off land just to pay the tax. At a recent protest outside the Northern Farming Conference in Northumberland, dozens of farmers gathered with NFU President Tom Bradshaw hinting at potential militant action. It's heartbreaking. Family farmers are the backbone of our villages. We're the ones supporting local events, keeping local shops running and building the community. Now, with this tax, it's like they want to erase village life. The Treasury claims these changes will impact only a small number of estates, but the NFU disagrees, saying family farms are already struggling due to rising costs and the phasing out of delinked payments. When I was a kid, there were dozens of farms here. Now, there's just one. Politicians don't get it. These aren't wealthy estates. They're hard-working families. This tax threatens everything we've built. Farmers argue that big corporations will likely buy up their land, shifting the focus from community to profit. They fear that the close-knit fabric of village life will unravel. Farming is already tough long hours, low return. Now we're looking at even less incentive for young people to take over. The soul of rural life is slipping away. Farmers held banners reading, No farmers, no food, no future, voicing their fears of disappearing family farms and the rise of corporate giants. During Prime Minister's questions, new Conservative leader Kemi Badenoch took a stand, promising to reverse what she calls Labour's cruel family farms tax. Kemi Badenoch says, This tax isn't just about money. It's about family farms, tradition and preserving village life. We'll reverse this policy to protect the heart of rural Britain. Keir Starmer responded, stating that Labour's budget allocates £5 billion for farming over the next two years. The biggest increase in years, he claims. According to Starmer, most farms will not be affected by this tax change. The vast majority of farmers will remain unaffected. This is about ensuring fairness while securing funding for vital public services, Keir Starmer said. The government also assured that the majority of family farms will continue to pass from one generation to the next and promise continued dialogue with the NFU. Our farmers are ageing with no one to take over. These policies don't just impact finances, they endanger an entire way of life. With a larger rally planned for November 19th, Farmers across the UK are sending a clear message to Labour. The countryside won't go down without a fight. What do you think? Is Labour's inheritance tax policy fair? Or could it signal the end of family farming in the UK? Comment below and stay tuned for more updates on this unfolding story.